Yes, Hey, Luis, um, how would you assess today and getting a start here? I mean, what, what did that mean for you and how would you assess how you did? I'm sorry, I couldn't, I couldn't quite listen to the question. So how, how would you assess today's appearance, um, your two innings today? Oh, well, I mean, uh, it was pretty good. I mean, except for the two walks, especially uh, walk in the first guy against uh, lefty, which is should be my, you know, I should dominate that guy. But uh, and then they were all humans, you know, after a drew walk, the guy can run, man. Uh, he stole two bases. They pretty much score without any base hit, uh, which is an uh, encouraged part of, uh, about my outing today. I, I didn't give up any base hit to, right, to righties. And I uh, felt pretty good. I was throwing the ball well. The ball was moving really good. Uh, I was throwing hard again. I uh, felt really good this, uh, this spring training so far. Uh, I'm being able to throw harder this spring training. I don't know how. But uh, I've been feeling really good. So, so far, so good. Yeah, overall, what do you think's been working for you this spring? Uh, well, I got to got to put credit with uh, the velocity. I mean, uh, I, I do believe I'm throwing a little bit harder this year, which has always helped. And uh, the movement of the ball, the ball is, move, is moving really good. Uh, I'm, I'm being able to uh, control the strike zone. I mean, obviously, I, I threw two walks today, but uh, in the sprint training, I've been able to, to attack the strike zone. I have a few strikeouts. So, uh, I think that's pretty much it. And, and can you explain the velocity jump? I mean, why, why have you been throwing harder? I mean, I changed my workout routine this year. I put some more weight, but uh, honestly, it's been a, a pleasant surprise this spring training so far. I mean, uh, last spring training, I was throwing 89. And now I, I think uh, my dad just told me that I top 93 today. So that's pretty good. I mean, I'm really happy for it. And I'm sure that's going to help me a lot. Did you say your dad told you that? Yeah, he's, okay, he, he's the one who watched the games. I don't. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Does he does he break, does he talk to you after a lot of your outings, or do you guys? Yeah, chat? he's a huge baseball fan. Uh, uh, he loved baseball, and he always, you know, tried to tell me about uh, how I did and how my former teammates did it and all of that stuff. So. Very cool. Thanks, man. All right. Maria Torres, the Athletic. Hey, Luis, nice to meet you. Um, I'm just going to do this in English, uh, just just for the sake of, of, of ease. Um, you, Davey's been, like, really um, positive about your change-up. Did you change anything with that, too, and be, having it be more deceptive? No, n not really. I, I, I have a lot of faith in my change-up. My change-up is my signature pitch. Uh, it's a really good pitch, and... Uh, but whenever I rely so much on my changeup, it made me vulnerable. So what I did this spring training, throwing more fastballs. So that made the batter think in another pitch, not, the, not just the changeup, which it makes it more com complicated for them. And uh, that's what I'm gonna try to do throughout the season and I'm sure it's gonna help me a lot. Uh, do you, did you, did you ever consider like putting on the extra weight or not the extra weight, but like the extra muscle before um, this past off season? I mean, why specifically this off season did you want to do that? Because I, I, I wanted to do a little change, you know? Uh, uh, I've been working uh, pretty much the same, the same routine for like seven years and uh, I didn't saw the result the last couple of years, especially since I've been throwing uh, less velocity, but this year I have to change a little bit putting some more weight in the weight room and it's working so far. So I'm glad that we did it. How do you feel about your chances at getting an opening day spot? I mean, you never know, no, uh, this is uh, a crazy business. They know what they're doing. And I feel like I did everything that I can possibly do. Uh, came here healthy, uh, getting people out, throwing strikes. And at the end of the day, that's their decision. You know, I feel I feel like there's a lot of talent in this uh, in this uh, this team. Uh, whoever they pick to fill out the bullpen roles, uh, I'm sure they're gonna do an excellent job. Uh, obviously, I feel like I did a good job this spring training. So we'll see. 
we'll see. And we still have like what, like three more games. So they still have to time to think about it, and we'll see in the end of the camp. Ideally, like, do you? care what kind of role the the bullpen is the bullpen situation would be like would you want to do more than you know pitch more than one inning face only a certain type of batter no I really don't care because uh I came up with the brave and in those uh years we didn't really have our set uh, a role per se except for Kimbrel Kimbrel was the only one who have uh, the ninth inning other than that we were just already I mean, they never told me what any I'm going to pitch or they just, you know, I just got to be ready. And that's, that's have been my mentality throughout my career. Thank you. Jessica Camarado, MLB.com. Hi there. I'm looking at your stats. You've, you have never started a game, right? During the regular season? No, never. I was a starter in, uh, in the minor leagues and winter ball, but never in the big leagues. What would you think if they wanted you to maybe be an opener this season? I mean, I really don't care. I mean, they and the end of the day, they pay me to do a job. It doesn't matter what inning it is. Uh, so if they want me to open the game, I mean, I'll do it. And it doesn't matter what inning it is. How is the mindset different opening versus like the seventh inning? It's a, it's a little weird because, you know, this is my first time. I'm sure if I do it, uh, if I start doing it more often, it's gonna at some point, you know, we're gonna get used to it. Uh, this this was my first time, first time since 2012, and uh, it was just a little weird, just for the fact that you know, just the first inning, uh, the mound is perfect, you know, the, the, it, it doesn't have any more holes, it's just yours, you know. It's just it was a little funny too, but it, it's just pretty much the same. Davey said that he wanted you to face like major league hitters by getting the start. So how is that competition? Uh, what, what, what did he say? I'm he sorry, said, I didn't... Oh, no, it's okay. He said that he wanted you to face big league pitchers by okay. starting the game. So how was that different from like maybe some of the competition you've seen later on in the game just to get that experience now? I mean, you still do it the same thing. It doesn't matter what inning it is or who you're facing. I mean, it's not like a, in the first inning I'm going to start throwing knuckleballs or something like that, you know? It's just, it's, it's the same game. That's why uh, uh, I'm happy that when I came up to the big league, I, we didn't, I didn't have a role. So I don't, I don't really, I'm not used to have a role or, you know, oh no, this is going to be my inning or something like that, you know, I'm just ready for whatever, whatever the chance it might be. Thank you. Mark Zuckerman, MassInSports.com. Hi, Luis. Um, if they do tell you that they don't have a spot for you on the opening day roster, but that maybe they could later on, are, are you comfortable if they want you to go to, uh, I guess it's not AAA yet, it would be the alternate site. Are you comfortable doing that or? Would you want to go look for another opportunity? I mean, uh, I'll, I'm I'm really glad to be here. Uh, I'm honored to be in this team. Uh, I like I like what I see so far, and I'm sure if I don't have if they don't have a open spot for me in the beginning, I'm sure at some point they're gonna give me a chance based on the performance that they're seeing in this spring training. So I'm perfectly comfortable to go that to go there and you know wait for my turn. Is that something you have to remind yourself that a team needs a lot of relievers over a season? Yeah, and I mean, just especially you don't make the, day. Yeah, especially for the way it is in the big league now. Uh, there's a lot of movement, you know, movement part that I always heard that. Uh, the big league roster is now about 26 guys now. It's more than that. So just, you know, I just got to be ready and wait for my turn. Thank you. Maria Torres. Um, you said that that the velocity, that you give a lot of credit to the velocity. Um, did Is there something that the Nationals have helped you with in spring training to kind of get more access to that? No, no, no. It's just something that... I didn't even realize that I was throwing harder. So to be honest, it was a surprise for me too, so. Thank you. All right. Last one, Jesse. Luis, you mentioned doing well against righties tonight. Um, was that important for you this spring to prove that you could 
you know, face both righty lefties and be effective in all, all situations? Yeah, of course. I mean, especially now where uh, the minimum three three rule, whatever it is, uh, it's in, because everybody knows that I, I dominate lefties. Uh, but the last couple of years, I've been a little ineffective against righties. So it's really important to me to show up this spring training and being able to uh, get righties out. So it was really encouraged for me to do that today. What's what's sort of something you think you need to do against righties to what, what? What's, what's something you've worked on against righties to try and improve your effectiveness against them? Is there anything different what, you do? What with I your was pitches? trying to do? Yeah, like is there anything different you do like with your pitches or no, I just uh I was throwing more fastball inside. Uh do you know so they they start thinking more about the fastball and not just the changeup because they gotta respect my changeup. So if I shown something, something else good, they gotta, they gotta, you know, start thinking about that other pitch as well. 